Hello everyone, welcome back to our channel. Friends, if you want to earn lot of money from Google, then you should watch this full video. I earn good money from Google. Friends, I already uploaded two videos on my earnings. Friends, if you want to know how much money I earn from Google, then you should watch my previous video. You can get that video link in this video description box below. Just click on link and watch them. You can see here Google paid me good money. You can also earn lot of money from Google. You do not need to do anything. Just you will have to make a best game. I will give you full tutorial on how to make a game design, how to monetize our game from Facebook ads and Google AdMob ads and how to upload our game on all free app stores. How to get unlimited traffic on my game. I will teach you everything. If you really want to make money online from Google, then you should subscribe this channel because I'm gonna teach you everything. Watch this full video carefully. First, I'm gonna show you I made this space shooter earning game on GDevelop software and I earn good money from this game. You can also earn lot of money from Google. If you want to play this game, then you can get this game link in this video description box below. Just click on link and download this game. Ok, so I'm gonna show you how to make this space shooter earning game. Now let's start the video. Before we start, make sure to subscribe to this channel and don't forget to click on the notification bell so whenever we upload a new video, you will be updated. And also please give this video a big thumbs up and if you have any type of questions or opinions about the video, don't be shy and just leave a comment down below. Now let's get back to the video. Ok, so if you do not have a GDevelop software, then just open Chrome browser and type here GDevelop. In the first, I'll tell you, you can make here lot of game design. You can see here all this type of game made with the GDevelop software. Ok, so you can also make this type of game. Just click here to download this software. Click on Windows. You can see here this software size is only 109 megabyte. Ok, so you can download this software in free. Now let's get back to the video. After installing GDevelop software, just click on create a new project. And click on empty game. Now in first I will have to make changes in game settings. Ok, click on properties. And type here your game name. Now type your game package name. Type your author name. Now I will have to resize game resolution. Ok. Select no changes to the game size. And change device orientation. It will be portrait. Ok. And after completing this game. I will add a remove app ID. Ok. Click on apply. Now click on add a scene. Rename this scene name. Menu. Click on menu. Just scroll down. And if you want to change this screen size, then click here. And click on cam settings properties and you can change game resolution size from here I'm gonna change game resolution width it will be 500 and height will be 800 then click on apply okay if you want to change background color then just right click and click on scene properties and click on this color ok and select any type of colors from here click on ok I will teach you in next video how to make an animated background in this game ok now let's see how to make a space shooter player click on add a new object and click on sprite type here object name 
for layer okay click on add an animation and click here edit with p scale and type here object name for layer and here you can make any type of polyar design i'm gonna make simple polyar design And then after making polar design, click on save and turn on this loop and now click on apply. Now drag this polar on the screen and change its size. Now go to menu events. Now click on this plus icon and click on group and type here menu. Now click on this sub event, add condition, other conditions, keyboard and select key pressed and type here left key press, click on ok. If left button will be pressed, then polyar will move in left. Okay, click on arrow action, polyar, and select arrow force. Here angle will be 0 degree, and speed will be 300. Okay, click on OK. Now copy this code and paste here and change it. It will be right okay now change its angle it will be 180 okay now let's preview it click on preview button yeah here we go it's working good okay click on menu now i'm gonna create new object i'm gonna create bullet okay click on add a new object a sprite and type here bullet it will be polar bullet add an animation edit with p scale and i rename this object name bullet and now change its size its height will be 32 and width will be 8 click on resize ok select this pocket tool I think it's looking good ok click on save now click on apply and now go to events add a new event add a new condition other conditions keyboard key press when a space button will be pressed then bullet will be fire ok 
click on array action and type here create select create an object and object will be bullet and its position will be color x position ok and here will be player y position now click on ok add a new event add action bullet and select add a force and its angle will be 90 degree and speed will be 300 ok click on ok now let's preview it click on preview button i think bullets angle will be 270 ok type here 270 degree ok go to menu and click on three dot edit object and click on edit points and drag this point middle of this polyar ok now click on close click on apply now let's preview it click on preview button yeah here we go you can see it bullet is creating middle of this polyar okay and a left right button is also working good so friends i will make enemy design and background design in next video i hope this video is helpful for you please subscribe our channel and if you have any type of questions or opinions about the video don't be shy and just leave a comment down below thanks for watching and i will see you in next video